Oh, shoot. Hey, everybody. I was just browsing the web. Gonna thank some of my Patreon people. Set this just right. Hopefully it's okay. I don't know. <coughs> Let me grab a quick drink. Uh, something shocked me. Hmm. I was going to my Patreon page to check out my supporters and stuff and thank them. Uh, because without them, uh, I wouldn't make the couple bucks that I do to, uh, that kind of helps me offset some of the cost. Not that it, I'm making much right now anyway. Need your all's help. But some of the supers I have, like Chris Kitchen, he became one of my supporters. And I clicked on his support thing here. At the bottom of the page, it shows my supporters and, and people I support also. And I clicked on his picture because I, I figured it would take me to a, a message thing, you know. But uh, come to find out, he signed up for Patreon and he has his own account now. So I went ahead and I just shared the link on Google Plus to Chris's Patreon campaign. In case, you know, you guys don't want to support me, that's cool. I'm fine with it. But maybe there's somebody out there, other content providers or, or, or people that make stuff that uh, you guys enjoy and want to support. Chris is one of them. He's been uh, right up there in the community just constantly going and going. His mind's always doing something. And uh, But if, if, if you want to support him, I, I posted a link in Google+, Plus, or you can check it out at uh, either come to my Patreon page, uh, patreon.com backslash Rick Sayer, and if you scroll to the bottom, you'll see the people that support me. Um, if you have, you know, if, if you like what they're, uh, those people are doing, you can support them too. Um, I would support you, Chris. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and say that now, but um, it would kind of offset everything. So, like, if you're giving, if you're supporting me and then I support you, it, it, we might as well not be supporting each other. So, how I'm going to support you because you are supporting me, I, I'm going to share everything that you do and, and do my best, just like I do everybody's stuff, you know. I know people probably get sick of, why in the heck is Rick posting next gen lens, you know, or why is Rick posting Virginia Pole Tracks artwork, or why, you know, we're getting sick of seeing this as like a running commercial in Google Plus or Twitter or Facebook or something, but uh, that's what I'm doing to show my support. I, uh, I mean, you guys are supporting me, uh, whether it be likes on videos or, or shares or comments or, some, or, or you know, sharing monetarily on, on, on Patreon. Um, the least I can do is, I mean, I make the worst, world's worst videos, I'm sure. No editing, nothing. I just, right off the top of my head. Um, I don't, I, I never, I say um a lot. I know that. I apologize. I'll get better. But I, I'm just shocked that uh, someone that I've been communicating with quite often since the Google Glass program um, started a Patreon campaign also, and I'm, I'm happy to see it. I, I think it's a, a great thing it, it, for no matter what you want to use it for. Um, me personally, I'm using it to better my website and and possibly put together a small team in the future once I get this paid off and, 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 then, and then try and create a, a, a total community supported type website to where anybody can post what they're doing or send me the links and I can share it and, and, and kind of get the word out there for everybody. I know it doesn't make sense now, but I, I, I can't put things in words too well, but I do see the vision in my head. Uh, somebody might be 3D printing something and, and they have a Patreon campaign. Why not support them? Um, I, I think it's great. And I'm, I'm Chris, I'm glad to see you here, man. I, I am. And if everything goes good with me through this year and the year 2015 and, and I could start to build myself up a little bit, I, I'm going to support you. Uh, I, I think what you do is great. Everything you've I mean, you've done so much. Look at that. Well, let, me, let me break into some of the stuff Chris has done for me to show you uh, why I wish I had the income right now to support him. Let's see. Did I put 
put it here? No, I did not. Well, uh, no, that's Virginia Pole Track stuff. Word of the day stickers and everything. Um, let's see. Okay, here's that. Here's some. This is for Chris. No, it's for Virginia. I might have put some of Chris's stuff in here. I need to start wearing this more. This is our a Pebble watch, which I do love. I messed up my other one. This one here was sent to me from Virginia Pole Track. Uh, I've been wearing my Android wear a lot more than this. And reason being, it's not because I like the Android wear better than the Pebble. I love this Pebble. I This is like a prized possession. It's gonna go in a, a with the artwork I got, I, I want to put this in the frame next to the artwork and have it under glass and stuff. I don't think I'm going to be wearing it much. It, it's a prized possession. I know it sounds stupid, but I've never had people send me stuff in the mail before. Kind of like what's in this package that I have shown in a previous... Ooh. I was looking for Stitch the other day because I pulled out the Lilo. That's a McDonald's Stitch stitch toy. Let's see if it'll focus. It's an old one. I, I collect these sometimes along with vinylmations. I didn't know those, didn't know those were down there. Cool, cool, cool. But uh, getting 3D printed stuff, I'll just whip one out. Uh, you guys ain't gonna be able to see it. Anyway, you hold these these tiles up to the light. Chris printed uh, this is the Mona Lisa. You guys probably can't see it because there's no light. But you hold it to a light and there are 3D printed images. Uh, he sent me whole packs. He sent me a whole bunch of these things. Uh, what a nice guy. I mean, takes time out. I mean, I can't even, I don't think I can hold all these in one hand. I mean, I got lots of, lots of these things. I mean, and then plus he set me up with a Tesla thing for my next trip home but uh, it's people like that in the community that think of other people in the community that uh, you just want to support uh, it, 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 it's it's like nothing that I've never I mean never it's like something I've never been part of before and I haven't uh, uh, it's it, this community is it, it seems to that we care about each other odd. Uh, we're an internet virtual family and uh, I mean we could call each other on the phone. You got a problem? You call somebody. I mean I've had problems. I, I had problems with WordPress when I first started this website. The glassgeek.com. Go to it. Uh, I had problems with WordPress. Called Virginia. She went and she did some research. She's, she's pro prolific I think is the word in WordPress. I, 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 I don't want to toot your horn there, Virginia, but that, I think that's what you told me. And uh, this was back a long time ago. And uh, she, she did something nice and, 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 and got all the info so it's easy for me to follow and emailed it to me so I can kind of learn WordPress a little bit. Uh, Chris sent stuff like this. Uh, Jason Ives sent me a cool uh, t-shirt from Future, Futurama. And, 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 and you can call them on the phone and you can talk for hours. Uh, it, 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 it's, we got a really good community. And if anybody in the community is trying to get support to maybe do a project or something, I think it's great that the community kind of helps back them and says, you know what, we know this person, we've known them for a year, known them for two years, and we read all their posts, we communicate with these people, and we know they're not we know they're actually trying to do something I'm gonna I'm gonna throw support you know uh, is it is it worth a cup of coffee a month is it worth uh, I may not be worth one of these these are three dollars a piece <laughs> a month but hey uh, I I feel I just wish I, I, I could do more than just share everybody's stuff on social networks trying to to, to help them out I wish I could help monetarily, but I'm a truck driver. Um, <laughs> a lot of people, including the IRS, think truck drivers make more money than we do. 
it's, it's, we don't. And I'm sorry about the glare. I got my curtains open here, and if somebody drives by, it, it, it comes in. But uh, anyway, I just make this a short, quick video because Survivor's downloading onto my phone now. I haven't seen this week's. So I'm going to sign off in a second. I just want to welcome Chris Kitchen to Patreon. Thank you for supporting me. I, I'm i a fan of yours, dude. Uh, huge fan. Just like I'm a fan of what Jason Ives does. I'm a fan of what Virginia Poltrack does. What Jono Poltrack, or Poltrack does. What Keith Barrett does when he's doing something. He, he's uh, The TTB Network is, uh, well, I'm, I'm a fan of the TTB, uh, of, of the weekly roundup, and, uh, so I don't get to see Keith as much, because I know it's a weekly Monday wrap-up show, or a, a, a show, <coughs> but lately it's been monthly, because I guess summer's here, and people are busy, and they just can't do the shows, but, uh, I'm a fan, and if they had something like this going, and I could support them, I would, uh, I, I just love this community. Love everybody out there. Uh, I, you, you know what? Uh, before I, I go, Roxanne Ruskin, she posts a lot of photos. And they're really well done. I mean, the, the, the layouts and and the way it's... Uh, what is that called? When you uh, put multiple photos. A collage. They're like collages of, of maybe a car show she went to. Or, or, a, or, or a book she's reading. Yeah, she has some white teeth. I wanted to tell her that too, but thanks, Stephanie Lake told her first. It would have sounded weird coming from me. But um, I'm a fan of her. Um, not only, I mean, she's a really, really nice person and, and, and makes you feel like you're a friend, but she also talented the way she edits her photos and does everything I... I'm a fan of a lot of a, a lot of the community. I, I love everything you guys do. I wish I could support everybody. And if you guys are doing anything, uh, have any websites going, and, and want promotion, send me the URLs so I could post them on my on the glassgeek.com. I'd be more than happy to. Photographs you guys are selling, doing T-shirts, coffee cups, mugs. Uh, battery packs for glass skins and anything or just 3d printed stuff I don't, I don't care i want to support the community and, and uh having chris and indian maiden I, i'm sorry i haven't talked about you this video but uh she's a uh, she that's another one of my supporters you can find her in my support area on patreon i it, it, we we got such a great community and the last couple of days, I've been kind of down and, and, and wondering if what I'm trying to do is helping or I, I, you know, because I have no way of knowing. I mean, I see the people that are coming to my site and OK, so you get a couple thousand people a day coming to your site. But are they clicking on the links that I'm providing and purchasing stuff from other explorers or Android where people are or people that I'm, I'm, I'm helping to try and drive traffic to? I have no idea of knowing if uh, anybody is using my site to click on your site and doing stuff. I'm assuming they are because I, I really don't have any content other than the, the stuff, you know, sharing your guys' stuff because the wording on my homepage and the wording on the other stuff, I haven't really changed it because it, it, it's a pain in the butt and it takes all, more than a half hour sometimes and my web developer wants $50 for every 30 minutes of work he has to do. So I, 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 that's why I'm trying to take control of it too, so I can start changing all that stuff up. But I'm kind of going off on a, I don't even know what I was talking about before, brain fart. Anyway, I'm going to go watch, catch up on Survivor. I'm stuck here in Houston, Texas until tomorrow morning, which tomorrow will be Friday. I'm picking up Miller Beer, Miller Beer going to Minnesota. So... Depending on how long it takes them to load me, I might make it to Dallas tomorrow night and kind of hang out a little bit Saturday 
and uh, maybe go over to the convention center. The big Android barbecue is going on. I know Kimberly uh, Kimberly Graham's going to be there. What was I going to say, Kimberly Clark? Do I know a Kimberly Clark? I I don't know. I don't know. I was going to call Kimberly Clark, but Kimberly Graham's flying out. A bunch of other people. They're going to be here in Dallas. And I haven't seen her since the Star Wars class meetup, so I'd like, like to kind of surprise her and, and maybe a couple other people. Even if I'm just driving by honking my horn. But they got to have parking somewhere around the convention center. Even though I don't have a ticket, at least I can text them and say, hey, I'm in the parking lot. Come on out and say hi. Um, maybe get some barbecue chicken wings or something. I don't know. I don't know what the barbecue is, what's going to be at the barbecue. Or if it's even a barbecue, it might just be called that. I don't know. Um, but I'm going to try and do that tomorrow, or Saturday, tomorrow. I just need to get to Dallas. Anyway, I'm going to sign off. Thank you guys for watching the videos, liking them, doing whatever, posting comments. Um, my mood has elevated a little bit. I'm not such bummed out anymore. That's what I was talking about, not knowing if uh, what I'm doing is helping the community at all. Uh and I don't. I know you guys probably don't know if it's helping you guys at all, neither, because you don't know who's buying your stuff um, or looking at your web pages and how they got there. Um, there's no way to tell. So all I can do is uh, I hope that I'm helping you guys, and um, and I'll try and do more. I just got. There is a truck out there with some chrome. And the sun shining on it is hitting me right in my face. It's like a mirror. It's like what Chris was doing today with the mirror, holding it up, or making it look like a portal. Anyway, I'm going to go sign off. I'm talking too much. I like to talk. <laughs> it's a bad habit. Uh, I'll see you all later. Peace. As I still reach around and try and find the off button. Ta-da! There it is.